Hey babes, it's me, Drea. And um, today's chat is to not let anyone, including yourself or anything, stop you from whatever you see in your future. So whatever you see in your future, even if it's for a split second, that means that it's something that you want to dive into, check into, get into, involve yourself in. If there is something that you see in your future that you want to involve yourself in, don't let anyone, including yourself, meaning your um, fears, insecurities, um, feeling inadequate, other people, what you might might think other people might think, or um, not wanting yourself to be seen, or feeling like you don't have what you need to accomplish the goal. But the fact of the matter is time. Time, um, in due time, you will have the as, um, the things that you need. In due time, you'll have the money that you might need to invest into yourself. In time, you will be able to conquer the fear of whatever it is that, is stopping you because the more that we work on ourselves, the more our brains get used to us actually working on ourselves. And we start to make progress in the direction of whatever way we choose to flex our brain muscle in regard to improving of the self. Your brain gets used to you doing that and it starts to embed in who you are as a person. And the more that you exercise that muscle in regard to yourself and your future plans, the sky is the limit. You will even find yourself multitasking with more than one goal at the same time because you have put yourself in the motion to get it done, all done. And you, you, when things are a priority, you prioritize it into... Um, basically who you are, so to speak, if you take it um, serious to a certain extent. So don't let anyone, including yourself, put your flame out and don't belittle yourself because of whatever it is that make you feel smaller than you really are to actually involve yourself and whatever it is, even if it's self-care, because there is um, situations where it's hard to do what you need to do for yourself on a daily basis. And it's hard to see in the future you getting yourself together energetically, physically, energetically to do what you need to do for yourself and um, around your house and different aspects of your life that you feel you might be dragging your feet unintentionally, but you can't help it sometimes. If if the energy and the motivation isn't there, it's just not. And it's kind of like God's way of forcing you to relax, chill, recover, recoup, um, talk to him, hear him. So don't feel like you are small or less than or not motivated because in time, again, time will bring the days back or will bring new days like the old days that you've been able to get it together. It's just um, practice of working on yourself like me. Is working out and I say I even got a plan that I have not done whatsoever and that is to work out every day every morning when the kids are getting ready for school it's like an hour and a half time frame where it's uh free for me but I'm like coaching them through the morning still like we don't do it every day but for whatever reason they still need me to tell them to do whatever on a consistent basis I can be working out during that time and I have not <coughs> excuse me and I have the equipment and everything I need I have the mental motivation but I don't but I don't do it because I forget 
And the reason that I forget is because I haven't made it an initiative. I haven't initiated actually doing it yet. So tomorrow morning, if I wake up and I remit, and I look over at my little contraption that I have to work on with, and I decide to do it nine times out of 10 every morning after that, my brain will put it in the routine to do it. And it'll be a breeze without me even thinking twice or hesitating about it. It might even get to the point where I look forward to doing it and having it accomplished for the day. But that is with time because today I didn't do it. Yesterday I didn't do it. If I do it tomorrow, then that is the time that life gave me to get it done. And then when I start to get it done and I'm into it and I start to see results, that is time that I involve myself with it to see the results. It's, it's time like, like this too shall pass. This too shall pass is a phrase where we know where it's like the within when we endure the better days are in the future and we'll be able to look back on it one day and say and remember it and recall how far you've come. That's this too shall pass. But at the same time, this too shall pass in a different light can also be perceived as at one point. You were at A and then in due time, the in due time, the in between time is too shall pass. This too shall pass, meaning in the future, it is you're going to be able to look back on it and be like, wow, that this I remember when I couldn't get off my butt and couldn't even remember to do what I needed to do, whatever, because I didn't make it a priority. I just made it a a goal. It's easy to make things goals without prioritizing it into your life. And a lot of times it's your own self that keeps that the case. So from here on out, as women and not even with, well, this is a community for those with um, no hair. But so I am talking to you, but I'm also talking to whoever else hears where I'm coming from. But for those that want to cut their hair, same thing. I get messages of people telling me that they want to do it, but they're hesitant or they're about to do it, but they're waiting till next week or they're want to do it, but they're nervous because of whatever the situation is when realistically this never the perfect time to do anything while at the same time every moment is the perfect time to do everything so get it happening in your life where you can presently see the result of you taking the step and every step after that will be that much more easier to see. So with that being said, everything that you have on your mind and your heart to do, do. Don't let yourself be the reason not to. Don't let things that creep into your mind be the reason that that you don't. Let Don't let other things in your life that seem like a distraction stop you. Everything you need to do in life can be done and it will be with the power of your heart and your soul and the initiative to get it done. Bye.